another video for you guys and girls. Engine stock 8.4 liter V10. Wanted to go through the interior for you guys. Car is running so I can show you the dash in a second. Seats, almost nowhere at all on the passenger seat. Viper floor mats. The Viper dash bezel is notorious for cracking or for chipping. A couple of tiny marks on that where the laminate is coming off, but very well preserved compared to most of these that you see. Quite a large trunk, new battery underneath the carpet cover there. Driver's kick plate, nice and clean. Pedals, let's look at the seat for you. Very minimal wear, little bit of wear marks from getting in and out on the bolsters. Little bit of wear, not cracking or, or, or actually um, damaged in any way, but a little bit of wear from uh, the seating position in these, as I'm sure you're aware. I'm gonna try to get in here for a second. All right, this vehicle does have the stereo navigation upgrade. Unfortunately, we do not have the navigation disc. I'd imagine that's probably out there somewhere to be acquired. Air conditioning works ice cold. This car is currently in Arizona, so that's an important feature. Go through the gauges. Vehicle just was started, so it quite, hasn't quite come up the temp yet. But you can see no check engine lights. That's simply just the emergency brake light is on. Turn that off. Of course, the seatbelt light. Idle. Exact mileage on it, 22.231 as of this morning. No issues, no check engine lights, car runs great.